What's going on, folks? Welcome back to Auditory Hotness. Today, we got something a little bit different for you. We got Yumandu Costa and Bebe Kramer and their newest, Sympathia. So if you're familiar with Yamandu Costa or Bebe Kramer, they are both from Brazil. Yamandu Costa plays the seven-string guitar. Bebe Kramer plays the accordion. This album self-released, and the style of music is what I am dubbing Brazilian bluegrass. So ask yourself, are you a fan of samba, tango, bluegrass, jazz? Do you like extremely technical musicianship because these two shred? And do you like impressing your friends with your new Brazilian jazz music that you found on Auditory Hotness? Any way you look at it, let's review Sympatia right now. Step one, album cover. Here's our album cover here. It's kind of a mix of uh, Picasso meets Don Quixote with the, you got the horse and you've got Kramer and Costa represented in the illustration here. So pretty cool. The old track listings. All right, here's our track listings for Sympatia. We've got 12 tracks. You're looking 47 minutes long. Average song length of three minutes and 54 seconds. Here are my key takeaways. Dear God, are they good. Unreal musicianship and technicality. The seven-string guitar playing is lightning fast. The accordion playing is out of control dynamic and adds so much texture to the music. It's, I can't believe I'm talking about an accordion right now. When you're listening to this, it's more of a conversation than it is music. You've really got to dig into this album and listen to the way these two musicians intertwine around each other. As I was saying before, the accordion work is almost taking the space of a harmonica in traditional blues or bluegrass music, while the seven-string guitar is absolutely lightning fast and filling up all the other space. Due to it having the lower register of the additional string, it really fills the sound out well. On a few of these tracks, they add just vocal harmonies that really give a dynamic texture and they're definitely more of like a vocalization than actual singing but definitely another unique texture to this incredibly exciting dynamic music these tracks are hot if you're looking to just pull a few tracks off sympathia to see if this is an album for you i recommend the following i'm going to butcher this one track two back barabad unbelievable mind-blowing technicality on this song and just through the roof interplay not to be missed. Track five, Sympatia, the title track. Again, you've got this really dynamic interplay, but this is one of the examples of those tracks where they add these vocal stylings and harmonized vocals that just give it a little bit of a differing feel than the rest of the album. And then finally, track nine, Papo de Año, which is a slower track, has more of this European romance movie soundtrack feel to it. A little bit slower, different than the other two, but those three tracks are going to give you a good flavor of what you're going to find on Sympatia. When are you going to listen to this? Well, first off, I would listen to this album right after you hit like and subscribe right now. Don't forget. But this is a great album for your whole entire house. If you have friends coming over, some wine, some appetizers, you're so classy. This would be a great album to throw on. Put this one on it, your Brazilian jiu-jitsu class. I mean, it's technical. That's technical. They're going to go together pretty well. And then after everyone has been sufficiently stretched out for the evening, go to the Brazilian Steakhouse, tell them to put this one on, and just continue the momentum throughout the night. You won't be sorry. If you dig Sympatia, I suggest the following as well. Jean Correa and his latest O Abismo de Prada. I did a review of that album as well. It's got the seven-string Brazilian guitar thing going on. And then also Bella Fleck and his latest My Bluegrass Heart. One of my least favorite titles of an album, but the ridiculous interplay in the musicianship here is very similar to what you're going to hear from Costa and Kramer on Sympatia. So enjoy this album. I know you will. Don't forget, like, subscribe, come back here. I'm giving you all the hottest jams, and this week is fire. Talk to you later. Peace.